Um, uh, it's not great. Would really like some of my ramp cards. I think I'll, I mean, I've got both colors. I've got Path to Exile to make sure I don't die first turn or something ridiculous. So I'll keep this. Um, I've got Hanging Back Walker as well, so I can feed some mana into that. And my opponent Mulligan to six as well. Oh, wonderful red. Well, sorry, Wall of Roots, a bit of ramp. Baghdad, uh, Bizarre Baghdad. So either the guy's playing, or my opponent is playing a um, thingy deck. Um, sorry, a um, reanimate deck, or yeah, I can't think of another reason why they would want to be discarding cards. So I suspect it's reanimate. Either that or the guy doesn't actually know how that what card works. Uh, the guy blatantly does know. That was very, very odd. Okay. Um, yeah, a bit confused by that. Unsuccessful vision. Oh, good. Three, four, five. Yeah, sorry, just eating some cheese. Um, so I should have enough to put um, Garukat next turn. Okay. Oh, that. I mean, basically, that's just primeval time for me because this will immediately go away. So I shouldn't even played it. That was ridiculous. Um, I got Path to Exile for Iona. Oh, uh, show and tell works differently. I that's stupid. I should have played Primeval Time. Um, I got it confused with another card where you just basically peak keep putting. Um, yeah, that was that was just ridiculous on my part. Wonderful first real play, and I make a mistake. Excuse me. Um, so how much land have I got? Uh, four, five, oh, three, four, five. Oh, I can still play Guruk. Good. Um, so. And prime time next turn. And then I might actually destroy all the lands. Yeah. <laughs> or alternatively, the guy just scoops. All right. Um, yeah, I mean, ignoring my just protect, I mean, yeah, stupid plays. That, that was definitely a punt. What do I want to bring in against this person? I don't really know what his deck does. Um, I mean, sneak and tell, or show, sorry, sneak, no, it's not sneak attack, show and tell, um, obviously brings in some big dudes, 
Path to Exile was very, very good, and I was fairly lucky to get it. Um, do I want something else, like Council's Judgment, or... I mean, because that's obviously what his plan is. Let's have a colour again. Oh, sorry. It's all back to CMC. Um, but, I mean, it's one card, so I think I've got enough other ways with my ramp type thing. I don't want to... Okay, so that's effectively a no-lander, which is really irritating because um, it's a really, really good hand. Uh, yes, so that's Mulligan. All right, that's good. I'll keep that. Um, I don't think... Uh, so I've got four then, which is enough for that, so that's five. So yeah, no, I don't want that. Ancestral vision. Okay, so this is how I'm more expecting his deck to go. Wonderful. Um, go to that. So I'm probably going to look for, I believe it's Savannah, um, the dual land I have. Let's always yield to that. Ancient Tomb. Okay, so he's got a bit of a ramp thing going on as well. Wonderful. Uh, Savannah. Um, actually, Savannah, probably not. Uh, that wasn't particularly great. Uh, whatever. Um, the thing I'm worried about is cards like um, Wasteland or Strip Mine. Strip mine. Um, I think both of them will get rid of cards like so, well, non-basic lands. I think one of them gets rid of all, of all or I can get rid of any type of land. Um, it's not a huge problem because I've got white anyway, so. Okay, so Master of the Wild Hunt. So I, I blatantly always want one of those out. Um, I mean, that he could bounce no end of things he could potentially do there, but he didn't, so I'm fairly happy about that. Did I not? Oh, oh he's casting it. Yeah, he's drawing four cards, so he's got 11 cards in hand. Which I suspect it means he's going to be discarding a ton. Okay, so he's got show and tell. So I'm going to put Blight Steel Colossus in this time. He's got Emrakul, which is great. But he can't attack with it, because as soon as he attacks with it, I get rid of all of my lands, and then swing him for, with Blight Steel Colossus. So let's play a land, pass the turn. Um, not attacking, obviously. He has a 15 15. Okay, good. Um, so that's six. So I got a couple more turns before I can kill. Yeah, I got a ton of turns actually. <laughs> Oh, I should have been attacking with him. Sorry, I forgot. He's indestructible. Um, so yeah, very much. Because this does it to... 
No, try creature. All right. So, um, so let's attack with him because he's indestructible, which I've forgotten. Sorry, yeah, that was again a fairly stupid mistake on my part. I think this is indestructible as well, isn't it? Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> is it not indestructible? No, it's not. Okay, yeah, I mean, I, I should have killed him by now. Um, next turn, he's going to get... I mean, he's got two more turns. Uh, of infect before that, sorry. So, I mean, okay, so he's okay, yeah. I don't know what he was doing there. Uh, oh, he discards that to get everything back, yeah. Okay. Okay, so it's a fairly quick uh, match. Um, the ramp worked really well. I will readily admit I was fairly lucky in a couple of places with the um, having Path to Exile in my first hand and also um, and the second one being able to put out uh, Blightsteel Colossus. Um, of course, the fact that I didn't realize that he had uh, Indestructible was slightly irritating, but hey. All right, so... Um, I will see you in round two.